Welcome back guys, it's been a while. Um, I've been busy basically sorting the car out. Today is the map day. I'm gonna be basically give you guys a quick update on what I've done. Um, it's been a blast. It's been a blast for this, it's been a headache. It's a chance of everything out because I had a very short time of making everything correct. Uh, so, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys a quick what I've done and uh, Today is going to be one hell of a day, so stay tuned. Since last time, um, obviously I put these uh, breeder line for the. I just want to keep it like the way they had it on stock from factory, so I just kept it like that. For now, this is only temporary uh, thing. I put new timing belt, new timing gear, that's HKS timing gear. That's a Tommy, Tommy that you guys call it, I don't know. Um, and then obviously I didn't go for dishwork injectors. I went for ID injectors because the dishwork injectors wouldn't fit um, That's the problem I was having with, with my injectors as well And I obviously put the radium rail, but you can't obviously see it. You won't you won't be able to see that I went for the radium rail uh, Obviously Temple Smart X and the wastegate Finally made it to RR Engineering. Uh, we're about to take the car on the dyno, and they're going to use a hub dyno to get the car mapped. Uh, I'm going to basically record every bit I can to basically show you guys what the process of basically uh, going to taking your car to the dyno and stuff like that. Silent boxes in the middle. I don't want to put it. I like the loudness. I just want to be loud and savage and sky. You know what I mean? I want to break it and make 184. <laughs> Show you guys layout because I can't even see 
uh, where the first pull was like around 320 wheel horsepower, around like four, nearly 400 brake. And this is the second pull, and he just done, but um, we don't know yet, but we're gonna find out in a bit. I think on the first round it was 320 wheel horsepower, that's what was that? 400. I think now, so we done the third pull, but we haven't seen it, so I'm gonna show you guys. for a plane. No, no, I'm trying. Just get under the control. Yeah. Well, that was, that was the fourth pull, but I need to go in back in there and basically look at uh, what, what power figures I'm getting. Because we were in there, but they had to close down the shop because it's just too loud. And all these people, like all the neighbors, like uh, other companies that are around here, they might be complaining about that's why we put the shots down. But damn, the car is freaking loud. Uh, battery died. Um, as before, Samuel, where are you going? Stop hiding. <laughs> um, so basically, I was just, I was just speaking to my mapper, and he basically said to me, um, the car at the moment is only pushing the spring pressure, so it's only pushing a bar because I've got 14 psi spring in there. So the first pull he made around over 400, uh, 400, just 410 brake horsepower on a crank, so that's like 330 wheel horsepower. So what happened is basically right now he's basically just messing around with the bar so make sure that the engine is pushing in one bar views. He said the manifold is great, the type is great, um, it's holding, there's no spikes or, um, or any creep. So everything's basically running smooth right now with the pressure and stuff like that and the manifold the way the car is running. Um, so far um, everything's running cool so uh, we're just having a little break, they let the car cool down and uh, we'll go again. So at the moment it's only pushing 400 crank, over 400 crank and just on our first pull, like first couple of pulls and then he's done a third and fourth and it's still like pushing over one bar. But he's going to start increasing up after this break and then hopefully we get the 500 brake horsepower. Here we go again. Oh, 
on the side to pause na ba? Five and three. Yes. Five and three. Five and three. Yes, we made it. We freaking made it. We made it. We made it. We made it. I told you guys. Power first, so I've got the power now. So now it's gonna be 